more degraded an area has become, uh, the harder it will be for life to come back. But uh, that said, I've seen even some of the most intensively fished areas around the world uh, starting to replenish themselves after they've been protected from exploitation. So in, in, the, in St. Lucia, for example, at the time when they established a network of marine reserves uh, close to fishing in the 1990s, there was um, very little that was worth catching left. And people would work all day and they'd come back with a, a bowl full of fish not much bigger than this bowl of peas. Seven years later, the fish stocks had increased to five times the level uh, that they were at the start inside marine reserves. And outside marine reserves, more importantly, they, the, the fish stocks had more than doubled. And so had the catches of the fishermen. They'd, they'd benefited from this overall improvement that had happened. So life in the sea is resilient, and it can come back. It won't come back to exactly what it was before, um, because in some cases, the fish just simply aren't there. They're, they're a, a It'll come back to something worth looking after. It, it certainly will, and something which will contribute materially to the uh, productivity of nearby fisheries.